video is about isomers and resonance structures. Isomers are compounds with the same molecular formula but different structures, and resonance structures only vary in the arrangement of electrons. This is an example of a resonance structure. NO3, the nitrate ion, has three different resonance structures. You can see that the double bond changes position in each of the structure. The molecular formula remains the same. There are two types of isomers, which are structural, structural and geometric. Structural A isomers, atoms are arranged in a completely different order, and there are three types of structural isomers, which are the chain, positional, and functional groups. In chain isomerism, um, it's possible because of the possibility of branching in carbon chains. For example, C4H10 has two isomers. In this one, um, the atoms are lying in a straight chain, and in this one, they are branched. The next type, the next type positional isomerism, uh, the basic carbon chain remain, remains the same, but important groups move around the chain. In this case, bromine in C3H7Br. So here it is one bromopropane, and here it is two bromopropane, because in here the bromine is on the end of the chain, and here the bromine is in the middle of the chain. The last type is the functional group isomerism. In the functional group isomerism, um, the um, isomers contain different functional groups, for, uh, like different compositional families. For example, in C3H6O, um, this is propanol, which is an aldehyde, and this is propanone, which is a ketone. Now we will take a look at geometric isomers. Geometric isomers differ from structural isomers because they have a different spatial arrangement but the same formula and structure. The type of geometric isomers that we will be talking about is the cis-trans isomerism. Cis versus trans. So in cis-trans isomerism, when there is a double bond in between two carbons, and the functional groups are on the same side of the bond, it is a cis-alkene. Cis so here you can see that it is a cis-2-butene. When there is a double bond in between two carbons and the functional groups are on opposite sides, it is a trans-alkene. So here is trans-2-butene. It, because of the spatial arrangement, the cis will always be less stable than the trans. Um, 